Hey everyone, it's the Pirate Kid, and welcome to another episode of uh, High School Romance. In last episode, Hoshi got incredibly drunk. Uh, that's really mo what mostly happened. Um, and Selena asked us to meet in, or asked us to meet in our dorm room, which she's already here because you know, fucking people let themselves in, I guess. Because we have no locks. Why do we have no locks in these dorms? Anyways, so let's just continue. Where did you think I was going? We said we were going to meet up here. I guess friends just let themselves in. I know we agreed to meet up, but still, I'll have to be extra careful about that. I was just surprised. So what did you want to talk about again? I kind of already prepped you for this, so I hope you warmed up to the idea. If not, I'm going to have to come up with another speech, or maybe just grope you enough to convince you. What? <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why grope me? <clears throat> Sorry, this really does a toll on my throat. Grope me? After school on Wednesday, Miss Rowan's uh, holding tra tryouts for this year. I wanted you to come. Really? If she wanted me to try out, wouldn't she have said something about it? At this point, I don't think she really has to. It's pretty obvious that you're talented enough to make it. The only reason you have to try out is to be fair to the other girls. So why wouldn't you try out? I did want to get involved in clubs and activities. This might actually be a good op opportunity. Bleh. Op, 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 op. Opportunity. And I'll get to spend some more time with Selena. I think some people would be jealous if someone threatened them at, their be at being the best. Selena just seems to like competition, even if it ends up beating her. But granted, I haven't actually won a race yet, uh, so I don't know. Alright, count me in. I'll give it my best. Uh -huh. You're so serious. You're going to get in, silly. Some of the girls you run past in the gym all the time are also part of the track team. So don't pull a tortoise in the hair, but you don't need to worry, about, worry much about it. I'm glad you're part of the team. Trials are at the sports field after class. We won't have to run Wednesday during the gym either, so we can be at our best. I think it'll be good for you. I'll see you there. W what? There's so many girls here. Oh, I guess even underclassmen try it out for the team. I didn't even think about that. Is track really so popular, or are there just not a lot of other clubs here? I would assume there are more clubs. Slingatown is so confident about my getting in, but now I'm not so sure. Shoji, over here. You made it. Ready? I guess so. Don't look so nervous. There's nothing to it. Just run like your life depends on it. Like you're trying to catch the ice cream truck. Or being chased by a serial killer with a hockey mask. You mean Jason? Or like all the girls want behind you want to rip off your clothes. What made you think of that example? You're right. That last one wouldn't be super terrible. So terrible. Alright, I assume she asked that lesbian question because she might be lesbian. But I don't know. That's not what I meant. Come on, we've got, we got to go line up. Or maybe she just knows that we're a guy, and she hasn't uh, said anything about it. Maybe she's in cahoots with the principal. Alright, I can do this. There's nothing to it. I can do it every other day in gym class. Ready, set, go! Ah, this is so much tighter than usual. Some of the underclassmen really are quick. What the fu- Alright, just real quick here. Because this is very important for games like this, for visual novels. You cannot have this many spelling errors or at least noticeable spe spelling errors like I hate to be that guy but honestly how are you going to just be all like oh yeah well fucking uh just this will be fine we don't need an editor like I don't mean like, that's clearly not what happened but I mean come on just you have to be thorough with these types of things um like have every like person go through the branch all the branches in the game just to make or like have a bunch of people go through the branches in the game just to make sure because you never know aside from that I like the art style which is amazing I prefer it significantly more so to the uh, to like the other visual novel stuff like freaking Sakura series or whatever this one actually is kind of adorable but yeah also I'm pretty sure I see a bulge in Shoji's pants she he should really do something about that some of the underclassmen really are quick Ha, finally. Most of them have fallen behind. There's just there's one just on my heels though. I don't like the look she's been giving me. And of course, E Selena who is E Selena? I ain't Selena, but I mean who is E? Or what's the E for? Ah, I guess it's just another error. Selena is in the lead. Uh whoa, she just tripped. Oh well I'm gonna stop and help, of course. God, that'd make me kind of a dick, wouldn't it? If I didn't help. Selena, are you hurt? What are you doing? Getting you back up now, are you hurt? No, I'm fine. Why did you stop? Come on, then. You've got to get up. You're crazy, you know that? Complain about it later. Let's go. Wait, is she actually complaining because I stopped to help her? I guess so. 
Girls are so confusing. Oh well, we have bigger worries. To, we have bigger things to worry about right now. We can still stay ahead of, ahead of this if we can just get moving again. There's a girl who was giving me that look. Come on, I'm not letting her be the one who beats us. What? Oh, God. <laughs> Hang on. I'm just imagining that one picture of Selena is just that's the only like image that she's or that's the only way she runs like just constantly like that and she's like Brr, just down the fucking lane she just took off i can't hope to catch up with that but i am gaining on the girl she must be wearing out will miss rowan count that fall against selena why are you worrying about that right now she was far enough ahead to actually trip get back up and still retake the lead surely she'll be okay and so will i now that i've passed that evil eye girl <laughs> rude I feel like someone threw a match in my lungs. I had to practically fall over the finish line, but I made it. Second place, right behind Selena. S Selena, are you okay? You're bleeding. Just a scraped palm. I've had worse wipeouts, believe me. But I really wasn't expecting you to come back for me. Why not? We're trying out to be part of the track team, right? Team members don't just leave each other behind. I guess that's true. Maybe I should have let you win as thanks. Nah, that's dumb. Because then they'd expect more out of me. I didn't even think about it. I don't think it about anything while running, really. I guess that's why it's so nice. Oh, I would have. I wouldn't have wanted you to let me win. Yeah, if I went against you one day, I want it to be fair and square. Ha! <laughs> All right, Shoji. That's the kind of spirit I like, even if you're too nice for your own good. Come here. Ah! Is this a hug or an attack? Is there also a weightlifting club I don't know about? <laughs> Thank you. Really? Well, that's nice of her. Honestly, I didn't even think about stopping for her. It just happened. Like my feet acted on there. Or someone was controlling you, Shoji. Who could that have been? Who? I couldn't imagine finishing the race without her. Or worse, making the team without her on it. Even if she wouldn't have been upset with me, I think I would have been. Yeah, I guess so. The track meet was enough to ex excitement for the week. Miss Rowan read the uh, new track team members' names over the intercom the next morning. Selena and I both made it. Of course you did. You came in first and second place. Since then, we've been having meetings pretty regularly. Between that and gym, I'm pretty worn out. I'm glad it's Friday already. Just one more day of classes, and then I can actually rest for a couple of days. Oh, wait. Oh, God. I stopped to do this one. Fuck. Why did I give her this annoying-ass voice? May I please have your attention for the morning announcements? Oh, God. As many of you are aware, our festival weekend is quickly approaching. Festival weekend? I haven't heard anything about this. Setting up a booth or exp exhibition can you earn you extra grade points. You will have one week to prepare, so please make use of the weekend. The festival begins next Friday, prior to our first term break. Further information will be provided on handout with handouts which can be obtained from your class representative. Please review these for submission guidelines. I look forward to your many wonderful submissions. Let's make this year's festival our best one yet. God damn it. Hmm, I'm sure Hoshi will have to participate. She doesn't really need the extra credit, but it would be expected of her. I don't really need any extra points either, and I don't know what I would put together if I did. It doesn't look too specific, as long as there's some academic or school-related topic. That's cool. I'll keep the handout, but I don't think I'll be doing anything for it. I'll, I'd rather focus on my studies. And Hoshi's gonna say that you're gonna fucking do this, because you're my bitch. Shoji, you heard the announcement this morning, right? About the festival? Yes, that one. If you're working alone, it's a really big project to finish in a week on top of schoolwork. I was wondering if you wanted to lend a hand. Exactly. Not to worry, though. I already started preparing the materials since I knew it was coming up. Jesus Christ, of course she did. So I just need someone, some help putting the actual booth together. There are actually prizes for the best exhibit, but really I just want to make an impression. A good exhibit reflects well in the class, even if it is a school-wide event. The competition never really stops. Unfortunately, you would be right with that assessment. So in the interest of our class, I'd really appreciate your help. No surprise there. You'll help me, won't you? Uh oh, we better hurry and get to the gym. Do you know what we're doing there today? I'll make you copies of our festival materials afterwards. Ugh, God, excuse me. That was disgusting. Alright, sorry. Wait, I didn't even get to agree. Wait, hang on, why the fuck am I talking like that? Oh well, it's not like I have any, anything better to do than help Hoshi. Hey, Shoji. Ah, uh, what are you doing here? Just finished changing. Oh wait, fuck. Bar barely, that could have been bad. Listen, I'm glad I caught you. I wanted to ask you something. You know about the festival coming up, right? We get to pick what we make an exhibit on. And if you weren't already planning on doing anything, I thought we could make one about track and field. It's fitting since we're both on the team, right? I think it could be really cool. 
if we do well, do it well enough, we might show up with all, all those other sports who think they're better than us. Just because we don't use a ball doesn't mean we're not a good sport. Maybe I'm just bitter. Still, I'd love to hear any ideas you have for it. We'd better go, though. I, I don't want to end up doing my gym in my underwear. See you out there. But wait, I'm supposed to help them both? Why does everyone just assume I'm going to agree? Oh man, what do I do? Oh no, I'm going to be late for gym. Wait, well, later than normal. After both Selena and Hoshi asked me to help with their projects, they didn't mention it again. But now I just woke up to two messages on my phone. They both want me to meet them after class today to help. I don't have, I don't want to have to favor either one of them, but what choice do I have? So who do I help? Yo, that's fucked up. That is some fucked up bullshit. Well, I guess I already helped Selena. So I can help Hoshi, especially since she, it's only fair because she asked first. So we're going to go with Hoshi. Hoshi did ask me first and she already has a lot of responsibilities being class rep. I should help her. You should at least tell Selena so she doesn't get angry. Please, Shoji, make reasonable decisions. Sorry. Thank you for agreeing to help me with this. Oh wait, fuck. Thank you for agreeing to help me, help me with this. I decided to focus on an academic topic. But I also wanted something that's going to attract people's attention. So I'm documenting the differences in nonverbal communication between men and women. How are you going to do that? This is an all-girls school. That's going to be very difficult. I think it'll work well, because I can approach it from an educational standpoint, but have lots of visuals. We can use body language examples from popular boy band singers. Though I don't know much about those. Hmm. We could ha also have a poster called What He's Trying to Tell You. That should be really popular with the girls, and if he's academic... And if it's academically based, the teachers should approve. But why is why this topic of all things? If she inspects my body language too hard, she might just find me out. Never even thought about something like that. Is it really all that different between genders? I can certainly be part of the hypothesis. From what general knowledge I have about the subject, yes. But I haven't actually studied it. Will you help me research it? I've already agreed, so I guess I have no choice. Sure, I'm not sure where to start. If we have time, it would be good to conduct some of our own research. For now, though, let's head to the library. I'm sure we can find credible articles that have been published. Can't we just use a search? <laughs> can't we just use a search engine? Of course not. We need academic articles, not a top ten list from some random blog. I wonder if everyone else is putting this this much effort into it. Probably not. The whole school is talking about the upcoming festivals. It's a nice change of pace from worrying about tests and exams. Aren't they the same thing? But there's still something I can't stop worrying about: the fact that both Selena and how she expect me to help them today. I don't like having to choose between them, but their projects are too different. I'd be useless if I tried to help them both at the same time. We'd never get anything done. So who should I help today? Fuck. God, I hate literally all of you for doing this to me. I can't. I hate this. Ugh, fuck. I'll have to help Hoshi. I'm really glad you showed up. Yeah, see, that would be a dick move if I didn't. Can you do me a favor? Can you look at these pictures and tell me what you think the people are feeling? The faces have been blurred out, so you can't see the expression at all. You have to tell strictly from their posture. Since I'm doing a study of body language, I'm making this into a game of sorts. It'll be informational, but fun too. People can see how good they are at reading body language. Sure, I can look over these. Also, make sure to note the difference between male and female body language. That's the hypothesis of the whole booth. Uh, exhibit, excuse me. We need to we need so we need to include it in all aspects of the booth. This is this. God damn it! My voice is starting to die on me from doing this so much it is a lot of talking. <laughs> this doesn't seem too hard. Then, we need to make copies of these pictures for everyone in the school, just in case. Th that's a lot of copies. Uh, it's the middle of the projects are all over the place. Some of the girls are procrastinating and are, are in a panic now. I bet they're the ones who need extra points the most. Tension is pretty high. I hope Hoshi and Selena are both doing okay. Now that I think about it, I haven't told either of them I was going to help today. Who should I help today? I'm going to help Selena then, if that's the case. Hey, Shoji. <coughs> Jesus. Nah, uh, let's try this again. Hey, Shoji. Now that everyone's cramming to finish their project, it's really crowded in here. It'll be even worse tomorrow when we have to set everything up. But listen, I've got a great idea for the track of shit. We're gonna be procrastinators. <laughs> okay. Alright. I knew we were going to have information about famous track athletes, but what about a picture collage? Wouldn't that look cool as the background? Yeah, that sounds like a great idea. Great. We're going to have to cut out all these pictures, though. But that looks like a lot. Where did you even get all these? I printed them out. How much ink did that take? Oh, maybe that's why the print... Maybe that's why the printer stopped working. <laughs> uh, let's not talk about it. We've got, this, we've got the pictures. That's all that matters. We might be here a while. Ugh, track guys are so fit. 
What were my parents thinking sending me to an all-girls school? I don't think I'm qualified to have this conversation to be having this conversation. <laughs> this is the last day to work on the exhibits for the festival. I heard rumors about some girls not getting any sleep because they worked through the night. I hope neither Hoshi or Selena did that. Yeah, don't do that, girls. That's that's a bad idea. We'll have to actually set up the exhibit today and make sure everything looks alright. That'll probably take a lot of time though. I won't be able to help both of them. Who should I help set up their exhibit? Fucking god damn it. I hate this so much. This is because this is the most irrational thing. Like, you would tell someone eventually, but that wouldn't make for good plot now, would it, game? God damn it, who should I help? I've helped Hoshi twice. Um Surely she wouldn't need help setting up an exhibit. I mean and then Selena still needs help. We all we did was fucking cut out pictures yesterday. Let's go with Selena. Shoji. Oh wait, hang on. Uh, let me just... <clears throat> Goodness. Shoji. I can't actually do, like, super loud voices of these people, because it's really hard. It's the last lap of the race, so to speak. I think this exhibit will help the track team get some major interest, don't you? It's too bad we already had tryouts this year. Are you looking for more competition? It should be nice, so what do I need help with? Well, we're supposed to set up these cloth screens behind the exhibit. That's where I'm going to hang out the collage and posters. But... But? We may have accidentally ripped ours while trying to set it up. You what? Can you get another one? Maybe, but I don't want the teachers to think I'm being careless with materials. I thought maybe you could fix it. Pretty please? Well, someone has to fix it. I'll try. There, how's that? Since I tapped it from the back, taped it from the back, it shouldn't look like there's as... Wait, what? It shouldn't look like there as any rip at all. I think it's supposed to be is. Okay. If there's a crease, let me know. Perfect. You can't tell anything happened at all. You really are a miracle worker. And good with your hands, too. That must really come in handy. Ah! I see what you did there. D does that- <laughs> does she mean something about that? Or was it just a really bad pun? I think it was a really bad pun. That's what I- that's what I choose to believe. Thank you so much. Now let's put up the collage. Alright, be careful with that. Don't rip it again. So why didn't you want to do your own exhibit? I don't really need to. How- how I suppose- God damn it! Developers, or writers, get your shit together. <laughs> How am I supposed to come for, how, how am I supposed to come up with something better than your idea anyways? Oh you oh you better be careful. Keep up that sarcastic tone, I might not be as grateful. Maybe it wasn't sarcasm. <laughs> Alright, fine, maybe it was a little sarcasm. But you really did make it look great. Aha! I surprised you, didn't I? Thanks for the helping thanks for helping out, Shoji. I hope you had fun. I did. Wow, look at all these little stands. They're so they're so do oh crepes. Dude, I gotta get me some crepes, bro. Alright. Festival really livened things up around here. It's nice to see results after, especially after how hard everyone worked. There are so many stalls about different things. Some of the girls do have interesting hobbies and crafts. That's a that's pretty cool. I like that. What kind of, what kinds of things are there? Looks like noodles, crepes. Uh, I think that's shaved ice. It looks like candy apples. Um, looks like like salad wraps. I can't see that far. Oh well. And then pies at the far end. I guess I don't know. But there's not really much here I'd want to buy. Fans and flower crowns aren't really my style, even in my girl persona. But I'm not going to turn down cotton candy. A guy can have the sweet tooth after all. Maybe I'll grab some after I visit Selena and Hoshi, though. Wow, her style looks busier than I expected. Now, what do you think his body language is saying about her? Hmm. Oh, wait. Oh, shit. He's definitely into her. Oh, God. This is going to be fucking atrocious. Okay. Jesus Christ. All right, let's... I shouldn't give her that voice, because I'm pretty sure she's going to be a main character, this person. Um, let's see here. <coughs> He's totally into her. I guess that'll have to do. How do you know that? Um, well, I don't know exactly. You might realize why you think... Wait, hang on. You might realize why you think that if you look through the book, it lists some subconscious cues that we picked up on. Oh, hold on, let me check it out. She's really teaching them how to read body language. Oh god, that's dangerous. I better stand like some of the girls around here. Okay, so he's leaning slightly towards her rather than away. And his feet are actually pointed in her direction. That means he isn't subconsciously thinking about leaving the conversation. Plus, his hands are tucked into his pockets, leaving his chest open. If he was closed off, the con if he was closed off to conversation, he'd cross his arms instead. Excellent, that's completely right. Here's a picture with his face not blurred out. See? Now it's much easier to tell that he's interested in her. 
they can tell that, maybe even more without seeing his face as well. <coughs> Excuse me. God, this hurts a lot. Isn't that a little too analytical? I'd say so, yeah. Oh shit, time's up again. I'm sorry, I just keep... I have a lot of fun with this game, but... Yeah, we're gonna have to end this episode off here. So we got the booths built, it seems like. I mean, I hope so. I hope everyone's alright. I haven't checked with Selena, but it seems like Hoshi's doing alright, so that's good. So yeah, that's pretty much what we did. We just built festival booths. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.